If you are an Isis Data Recovery Wizard user, you might be very familiar with this pop-up message when you attempt to save the recovered files. You might have this question, why files can still be crafted after recovery? It's a good question, and to find out why, you need to know what happens when the file is saved on a hard drive. A hard disk is logically divided into millions of sections, and each section is called a sector. A sector is the smallest physical storage unit on the disk, while a cluster is a group of sectors that are connected with each other and works closely as a unit that can be allocated to hold a file. As a file is written to the disk, the file system allocates the number of clusters to store the file's data. If the contiguous clusters are not available, the data is written elsewhere on the disk. This commonly happens on a hard drive that has been used for a while. Each file has its directory index. It works like the catalog and tells the system where the file begins and quickly locates all its relevant data. When a file is deleted, its data area and directory index are not physically removed from the hard drive. The directory index is marked as deleted, and the space occupied by a file is marked as available in the system. When you use Isis Data Recovery Wizard, the files that are found are actually not written to the hard drive at this moment. What you see right now is a directory index temporarily stored in the memory. It is a read-only operation and will not overwrite any files on your hard drive. However, if you decide to save them back to the original drive, since the sectors of all your lost files were allocated as available, the new files you save will be written to these sectors and destroy the data that were previously stored here. This is an irrepealable operation. Once happened, your files will be completely unrecoverable. Therefore, we suggest that you recover the files to another drive. Hope this video can give you an insight on how to properly recover your files. If you have any further questions, just contact us via email and don't forget to subscribe us to get more interesting tutorial of our products. Thank you for watching this video.